Hello everybody. Today we are doing a major cleaning and reorganization of my apartment. If you um, are new here, my name is Lexis. I'm 25. I live in New York City and I recently just got a fumigation treatment for bed bugs. Super fun, super gross, um, but everything's all good now. It was more of a precautionary treatment because I only found one. It was an adult male. There was no sign of bed bugs anywhere, but it was more of just a precautionary thing. So I've been going through that for two weeks. And all of my stuff is currently in bags and I'm going to wash all of my things, clean my apartment, organize. I have some friends who are coming over to help me. And I thought I would take you along with me too because uh, we started this journey together and we're gonna end it together. Currently, I am with my friend Colton and he says hey. <laughs> and um, we are going to the laundromat and we're gonna start this long process of washing things. So super fun times. So I'm. we're just gonna start. I'll update you as we go along and Let's organize this apartment. And if you forgot, this is the current state of the apartment. There's Colton. So. Let's do this. I already changed my shirt because I was sweating through the other one, but I have a feeling I'm gonna sweat through this one too. We just put our last load in the dryer. And we have these super cute laundry backpacks. <laughs> Not me like in that. <laughs> I can't walk in public. Um, but we did it. We've been going for about two hours doing this, but it's going way smoother than we thought it would. So, one load left. Thanks to Colton and Emma for helping me out. <laughs> and no one else, no one else helped me. <laughs> all right, we're back. We did all the laundry. We did probably nine or 10 loads. It's now 4.30. So we did it for about four hours, but we made it, we did it. Um, and now Emily is here, and me, Emily, and Colton are going to start putting everything back together in my apartment. Okay, clothing is going well. Emily just folded all of my clothes. <laughs> I've been hanging some stuff up. Colton helped a lot, but he left. And now I'm unboxing some random clothes that I ordered weeks ago that then I never opened them when they came because I didn't want them to get mixed up in all this chaos. Cute, this was be like a dupe of a Skims oh, bodysuit. And then this had two Fabletics credits. Cute. So of I course got it's green, like. Green joggers. But then look, I got a matching sports bra. Oh, cute, I like it. I got this bra, which will this even fit me? This bra, which has like mesh. Cute. I hate this overhead lighting, but we needed to see. We ordered some food, and now we are going to kind of reorganize the whole place. Oh, this would be like cute for me to set my- There you go! So we're- we're thinking about maybe switching up my mirror and my little bookshelf staircase ladder type thing and putting this here and then moving my mirror over there somewhere. We're gonna workshop it. Also, I feel like this vlog like doesn't exist. I feel like I haven't, so much has happened today and I feel like I haven't vlogged any of it. I guess let's get the well, desk Well, I thought we there. said maybe the piano here, the desk there. Yeah, but now I'm thinking maybe it should be the other way around. Well, I mean, that'll be easy to just switch your Yeah, 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 that's what I'm saying. Okay. Oh, you moved this. Yes. I'm gonna try to get them in the same bag. The guitar. Oh, I learned to play. Maybe. I've had this guitar since I was in eighth grade. I literally bought it when I was 13. I paid $250 for it. I saved up all my money. And I never learned how to play. But now I'm, I just feel like piano is more me. I'm not really a guitar girl. Oh, Bennett, no! No! no. <laughs> Bennett, absolutely not. No. That's so dangerous. There we go. No, Bennett, 
ordered some Thai food from my favorite place, VIV. We're about to chow down and then we're gonna tackle everything else. Who? oh, the mirror's here now. That's crazy, you can see the reflection. We got Thai food. Um, so I got red curry, my favorite. Emily got pineapple fried rice. She thought it was gonna come into pineapple and it didn't. And now <gasps> she's literally on a crazy rampage. <laughs> Everybody stop what you're doing. And now to unbox the rest of these bags. Yeah, unbox the rest of these bags. Let's freaking do it. It is looking a lot better. There's still a lot to do. But it's reunited with his baby. Ah, We're going for it and things are, it, we've switched the desk and this table and things seem so much more spacious, it's insane. So I don't know if you guys remember, but about a year ago, I found a picture of these two guys in my fireplace that must have used to live here. I don't really know. And I have kept it all this time because I thought it was funny. And I found these like cheap frames I bought from Ikea. So I framed it. And so these guys are gonna be framed in my apartment. <laughs> I feel like I need names for them. So Emily left. It was a crazy day. It really was, but we did it. I'm loving how the apartment is turning out. I need to order a new rug. I just had like two little runners and they worked for a little bit, but I would rather just have a real rug and they were kind of gross. I ordered some organizational things online. I have this bag back here that is all stuff that I think needs to be dry cleaned. I can't actually wash, it's like coats. I mean, this is a really good start. And I am obsessed with moving this and this. I love it. I also have a lot of stuff to do in the kitchen and the bathroom just to kind of put stuff back together. I think I'm gonna take a shower, get ready for bed, and I will talk to you in the morning. Good morning. I feel like to organize my apartment, I've been having to get completely ready <laughs> and like look nice because I feel like when I feel clean and presentable, then I just get more work done. Like if I was dressed like garbage, I probably wouldn't want to do it. I never wear this top and I still can't tell if I like it. I don't know if it's my color. It's from Maritzia. Um, but I can't wear it <laughs> if I'm doing anything too heavy duty, like anything. I usually don't wear it to dance or anything because I will sweat right through this baby, so. So good morning, welcome to day two. My friends and I started this thing where instead of scrolling in the morning on our phones when we wake up, we immediately find a song and we play it and get out of bed. And like while we're listening to the song, just start getting ready. My friends have been doing it all week. I have been a disaster and waking up at 10 and being all stressed, but <laughs> this morning I woke up at nine and I finally decided to do it. And I sent it and I feel like it's a really good motivator because I feel like I've been saying since literally the year started, that I've been having such trouble motivating myself to get up because I'm on such a different schedule than I used to be since I no longer 
have my full-time job and then it was just playing like songs after and I was in a good mood I feel like I never listen to music while I'm getting ready or doing anything I don't know why because I enjoy music but I think finding new music stresses me out, so this will be good because I can like maybe find new songs. I don't know, I just always forget to turn on music. The other day I went to the gym and I did a full 30 minute workout in silence and I didn't even notice until it was over. Like that's psychopath behavior. My workout ended and I was like, oh, I just did that in silence. Weird. I think I'm on my own today, no friends to help because the heavy lifting is done. All the laundry's done, Emily really helped me organize, and today I'm just gonna kinda do the remaining things. I ordered all those new organization things that are coming in today, so I'm gonna work on that. Um, I have some things out there that just still need to be put away and found a spot for. I have two things I need to build in the bathroom. We'll see if I end up doing that in this vlog. I have a new shower thing. It's like a tension rod that holds on my soap because I feel like the one on my shower head is getting so heavy that it's going to literally make it fall out of the wall. And then I have a little rack to put over my toilet that I can hang my towel on because my mom told me this looks tacky. So I have a fancier rack to hang my hand towel on, but then also I can roll up my spare towels, put them in there, and then there's a little shelf on top that I can put other stuff on. So then that's going to clear up the bottom shelf of my organizer that is a mess, as always, to put other things in. I really love this bookshelf here because now I can film and talk to you and get kind of like a good view of the room. I don't know. I feel like I just look weird right now. I can't explain it. The birds are going crazy outside right now. It's a warm day again. It's already 55 degrees outside and it's a high of 64. It's kind of humid and might rain a little bit and a little cloudy, but I'll take it. I'll take it. I am gonna go to Dunkin' because <laughs> this is my last day where I am eating out. I have so many leftovers in my fridge from eating out this week because I just didn't really have any groceries, didn't want to cook, a lot of my appliances were covered up. So I have mac and cheese, I have chicken salad, I have Thai food. So I'm gonna eat all my leftovers today. I'm gonna go get coffee from Dunkin'. I'm literally obsessed with Dunkin', I have one every single day recently. But that stops tomorrow, because tomorrow I'm finally gonna go to the grocery store after like three weeks. I literally have not been grocery shopping in three weeks, and I'm gonna start making my own coffee again, and all of that. And I'm excited to do that. Like, I miss cooking and like making healthy meals. I feel like I have not had enough vegetables in the past week. This whole process has been a little financially taxing. I have gotten rid of so much stuff. I feel so much lighter, and I feel so much better already. We do need to figure out today about this dry cleaning situation. I have not looked into that yet. I'm gonna go grab my Dunkin', and then we'll come back and I guess we'll get to work. I literally have no plans today. My friends asked me if I wanted to go out tonight. I was like, no, I've been spending way too much money and I need to do this. And I need to edit a video as well. I need to work on a little bit of editing. So it's a you and me day. We're cleaning, we're editing, and yeah, I'm ordering ahead. And I have enough points for free hash brown and a free coffee. It's a good day. I had to turn my AC on. It's becoming AC time. It was a little cold for me to wear shorts outside. I had a jacket on. Oh. Bennett is going crazy because he can finally run again. Like there was nowhere for him to play or run for like two weeks. And so he's so happy now. And he has his toys back. He had toys while it was going on, but only like two or three. Now he has all the toys. So I'm gonna eat and then we'll get to like organizing stuff, but. First, I'm gonna eat hash browns and some Greek yogurt. It started raining and got so gloomy. I naturally just had to play piano for like 30 minutes because I haven't had access to my piano for the last two weeks and I missed it. So, had to do that. Now we're gonna start cleaning and organizing. Okay, all the stuff I ordered yesterday just came in. floor is so creaky because I have no rugs right now because I got rid of my runners and I need a new normal rug but I haven't ordered one yet. I just called and found a pickup service for my dry cleaning. Um, it's raining right now. I feel like I literally took 12,000 steps yesterday just doing laundry and I simply could not go walk to the laundromat or a place to drop off my dry cleaning. I know that sounds terrible but I couldn't do it today. So I'm having someone pick it up. I got a steamer yesterday because I never have owned a clothing steamer and I have like two dresses that are pretty expensive They're like the only expensive things I own that I'm just gonna steam clean and then every single thing should be clean Hopefully they come soon and pick those up. I probably won't get them back for a few days Not that I really need them anytime soon. Okay, dry cleaning picked up 
Oh, I hate that my lights are on and it's so gloomy. It's only like 2.30. I think Bennett is so happy to be back in his bed. That doesn't really look that comfortable. I have really been procrastinating for the last hour and a half. Um, because I just, I don't know. This is all like exciting stuff that I'm doing. I have to build some things, put some things together, organize some things, like it should be exciting, but I have such a hard time focusing on anything when I could be doing so many things and like everything is a possibility. I cannot focus and I get really overwhelmed and I find myself just like sitting and watching stuff or like scrolling on my phone. Even though like I'm really excited to do this stuff, but it's like hard to make myself do it. I think maybe I bought desk organizers. I think that might be a good thing to start with. So like I just said, I bought these desk organizers to organize the inside drawer of my desk. Oh, ooh. Maybe I can move this over a little, actually. Yeah. It just hit my piano, but I just have to move it over a little bit. <laughs> For a minute, I thought they were too tall. I was like, there's no way. I don't really know what I'm doing. Here's what we're working with. I fit as many as I could in here. They also came with these like little sticky things that I can stick them to the bottom. I'm gonna hold off on that for now because I feel like that's not super necessary. Ta-da! Much better. So much better. My desk drawer was terrifying before this. Uh, it's so dark. I like could turn on the light. No. Uh, now I'm gonna open the stuff that I got on Amazon yesterday. I'm already forgetting what I got. Some hangers. My little steamer. Um, drawer dividers, because there are a few drawers that I need to split sections up. Pants hangers and my Playbill binder, which <laughs> I could have just got a plain black one, but I wanted to get this cheesy one that says my Broadway collection. And it's probably gonna fit every single one I have, and then I'm gonna have to order another. What are you doing? Say hi, Bennett. I have really never used a steamer. I just, I'm lazy, I'm a wrinkly girl. What can I say? This, it's like a hair dryer. It's amazing. It's so easy. I have the best reviews on Amazon. I'll link it in my storefront. I had to turn on the lights. It's just so dark and gloomy outside. Um, but next up, we are going to continue organizing my closet. So I got some new hangers that are going to store my pants better and then I can like collapse some hangers. Oh, okay. So I think I hang it up like this, put all my pants over it, and then collapse it. Okay, I put pants on this thing, but I also use these little holes right here to hang up the matching tops to some of the pants. I don't know if that's what it's supposed to be used for, but we're going with it. Look at that. Look at that. Oh my gosh. All right, both are in. I have my skirts and I have my pants. Now I have just these black plastic ones. Oh, they don't look as classy as these nice metal ones I got. They're not metal. a closet so it doesn't really matter what it looks like I love how these are organized like I have one of these things just for my jackets and then like one just for my tops and it looks so nice but then when you put it all together it looks kind of messy I'm not a big fan of that it's like so much easier for me to find stuff 
Tell me why I just like sat down to take a little break and I feel like it's been like 45 minutes. Oh, see, this is why I've recruited so many friends to come help me because I am just awful at being self-motivated with stuff like this. It's so hard. Like I have to like make a list and say specifically what I want to do, but I definitely am just someone that works a lot better when I have someone else holding me accountable. Like if I didn't even have this vlog, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so Emily organized my drawers for me, but she said that <laughs> there's one drawer where it's kind of like miscellaneous stuff, like it's pajamas, sports bras, and bathing suits, because I don't have that many of any of those. Um, so she recommended I get these little divider things to divide up the sections. So that's what I got. Got a little brighter out, but now the sun's gonna set like in well, actually, I guess it's not gonna set for two hours. I keep forgetting that it's daylight savings and I love it. I think I'm gonna try to put my coffee bar back together a little bit right now. All right, uh, I decided I wanna clean every single thing on my coffee bar and like do a Nice internal clean of the coffee pot, the espresso machine, all of that. Just to make sure we're good. So I'm gonna do that. Um, I have to do a little bit of reorganizing on the bar cart, aka coffee cart, because um, I feel like I have less stuff on it now. I might attempt to move my alcohol back out there on the cart. There's a weird truck doing weird things outside as usual. Do you hear that in the background? So I used to have my alcohol on <laughs> this cart. Then I took it off. Now I think I want to put it back. <laughs> I kind of was feeling like there wasn't much to do. <laughs> like this morning when I woke up, I was like, oh, there's not much left to do, but there's actually a lot more than I think. I think also because like I'm trying to clean everything as I go, but I may have to do the bathroom stuff in the next vlog. So here's the thing. I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. I've gotten a lot of progress done, but I still have a lot to do. And I'm filming a weekend in my life this weekend, so I'm gonna continue working on it and filming it. But I kind of need to edit this video. And I'm kind of tired and I want to eat and take a little break. And this just feels like a nice natural stopping point. I might even continue filming tonight if I feel super inspired, but it will be part of the next vlog. So let me show you the current status of my apartment. I'm like looking around and I'm like, hmm. Do I wish this looks a little better? But I need to remember where I came from, where I started, which was yesterday, where it was insane. So we're definitely doing it. I have some more things coming tomorrow. I have like a better storage unit for Bennett's toys. I need to order a rug still. Um, and I'm excited to do the bathroom organization. So maybe we'll do that in the next vlog. I just wanna say thank you to everybody who's given kind words and encouragement as I'm going through this. It could have been a lot worse and I'm very lucky that it wasn't as bad as it could have been. Obviously this still wasn't ideal, but I'm feeling good kind of having like a fresh start with my apartment since I've lived here for a little over a year now and I haven't really done like, okay, actually that's a lie. I was gonna say I haven't really done a deep clean, but I've reorganized like 15 times. I haven't gone through my stuff like this and been forced to throw things away and donate things and get rid of things. So this was good. I literally feel like I have 50% less things in my apartment. So I'm feeling a lot lighter and just a lot better about it. So it's been kind of a crazy month. <laughs> and I'm excited to finish this in the next vlog and then kind of get back to normal, back on a normal schedule. And once I am done with this, I will chat with you guys about everything else going on in my life. I feel like I've kind of just centered it on this right now. And this is all I can think about or talk about to keep myself sane right now. Thank you to everyone for being kind and being nice. Thank you just for watching and subscribing. And I am very thankful also to have this community while I go through things like this because it really just makes me feel not as alone. And it's just a good way to keep track. And one day I'll look back on this and be like, wow, 
when I was in my 20s in New York City, I, I really did that. That happened. So now I'm just rambling, but thank you so much for watching. If you haven't yet, please subscribe to my channel, give this video a thumbs up, and I will talk to you in a few hours probably, but for you in the next video. Bye.